dive deep into that. <laughs> a little bit. A little bit. So uh, when we, uh, we'll start off, and if you have a question, please raise your hand and just be loud enough so we can hear you. Does anybody want to start this off? First of all, thank you for coming. No, thanks for having me, bro. It's yeah. fantastic. Uh, if you can, if you want to just, we'll meet the questions, if you want to share the entire storyline of season two of the Walking Dead. <laughs> that would be great. Good job, too. Yeah. If you want to whisper in my ear, I will not reply. But, you know, I, I did see uh, the opening episode of season two day before yesterday. They played it at lunch for the crew in this sort of airplane hangar. And uh, it's fucking amazing. Like, honestly, it's, it's, all of us are just blown away. So, uh, you're gonna be really excited. Excellent. What's the first question? Yes, sir. But on The Walking Dead? Yeah. How, how fun is that job? Yeah. Dude, I, I run around with a crossbow and shoot zombies in the um, it, it, it's a lot of work, you know, Frank uh, wrote that character for me because I wasn't in a graphic novel. Um, and, you know, I kind of went in and I, I tried to make it more than one dimension, you know, because it's, you know, it's written, fuck you, fuck you, asshole, fuck you, you know. So I tried to tear up in between fuck yous, basically. Uh, and and uh, it, it works, like, the, you know, the, the fans really like that character and he's sticking, you know. Uh, it's a blast, you know. It's, I think it's my favorite job I've ever been on. Next question. Yes, ma'am. Um, were you surprised that EMC like, put on a so that you were able to be a good hit the show? Like, you know, I, I mean, I heard it's weird because like, I can't show a nipple, but I can shoot a kid in the face. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, it, it, you know what I mean? It's, it's weird. Uh, but I, I think one of the reasons, you know, they initially brought it to AMC was so that they could get away with it. AMC's a pretty ballsy network, so, yeah, so, I, I mean, I'm not surprised, although, there's some stuff in season two that is really pushing the envelope a bit, you know, which is awesome. Uh, Greg just won an Emmy, Greg Nicotero, for his zombies, um, so he's, you know, full of gusto and ready to get ass right now, so, uh, uh, yeah, and there's some zombies in season two that are, you know, they should be in the Smithsonian, you know, they're amazing. Question. Anyway, hey, uh, I have a question. What is your opinion of uh, Frank being fired after season one? Um, I, you know, I can't. That's a good it. question, right? Everybody's got it. I mean, it's all the way You guys will ask me how they can think it is. I, I, can't, I can't really tell why that's next. I, I can't really talk about some stuff, you know. Um, the thing with Frank is, you know, we love Frank, and we've all, we all came to work with Frank, you know. So whatever went down, we'll probably never ever know. Yeah. what went down, but Frank's vision is still there. Um, the guy that um, came on as showrunner was Frank's number two and handpicked by Frank, and Glenn Lazar is kicking ass, and he's really working with the cast and the crew, and, it, and he's really, really bridging the gap if there was ever a gap, so we're loving him. Excellent. And as far as Frank, man, uh, I'd do anything with Frank. Frank is, you know, he's a genius, and he's one of my favorite people. Excellent, yeah. Next question. Yes, sir. Uh, the word in the air is that Troy is writing the new one. So everyone hound him to get up off his fat ass and finish him. Uh, he's, I think it's going to go uh, heavy on the two brothers, like the first, first one. Um, and he's, I think he may want to end it there forever, so I, I imagine it'll be full of bullets, and full of blood, and full of fuck yous, and, you know what I mean? It'll be over the top and see. That's what I'm going to say. Excellent. Next. Anyone? Yes, sir. Uh, right, we're here in the black, I'll take you first. Yep, right, yep. Insane families on the show. So, I, 
you know, and, and it's set up that it would be great. It would be, you know, murder, explanation, murder, explanation, you know, just like the movie. Um, so I think it would be great. As far as that happening anytime soon, I seriously don't think so, because I'm busy with zombies, you know, um, which is fun. So, uh, I'd like to do a third movie before it became a television show, anyway. I'd like to, I'd like, you can't just leave us hanging in a jail, the way we you know. You know. So, yeah, I, I'm not sure, but that TV show would be fun, though. I, you know, I've never really done TV, except little tiny things here and there, but um, being on TV, it's actually a lot of fun. It's, uh, you know, I live out in Georgia right now. Um, I've been there since June 1st. I'm there until like Thanksgiving. Um, I have a motorcycle out there. I kill zombies, and then on my days off, I just go for hours out in the woods, you know, on my motorcycle, just rolling around the country with the cows and horses next to me and nobody else, and I'm in heaven. It's, yeah, it's just hard on everything. In the white? Yes. Sir. Yeah, it's totally interesting. Uh, next question. 